Welcome back fellow Reds and all football fans, kindly subscribe if you're new here. As the pressure continues to mount on Eric Ten Hag in the Manchester United dugout, the Dutch coach could well be out of a job if his side fall to defeat at the hands of Aston Villa today. A Premier League trip to an inform and confident Aston Villa side is the last thing Ten Hag would have wanted before the October international break. The villains are already six points better off than Manchester United this season and head into Sunday's clash off the back of a memorable and hard-fought 1-0 win over Bayern Munich in the Champions League. Bruno Fernandes is available for Manchester United at Aston Villa after his red card against Tottenham was resigned on appeal. The availability of Fernandes is a major boost for under pressure Eric Ten Hag, who is facing arguably one of his most important team selections in charge of United. Kobe Maino is a doubt after missing the midweek Europa League draw at Porto. Matic Delight has been subject of criticism for his poor form and Ten Hag is facing calls to restore fit again Harry Maguire to his defense after his late equalizer in Portugal. United have conceded six goals in two matches in the past week, but options for defensive changes are limited with Luke Shaw, Lenny Euro and Tyrell Malaysia all still unavailable. Victor Lindorov and Johnny Evans are unlikely to beat her in two as starting options, while Ten Hag is very short on full back cover with right back Diogo Dalot already filling in on the left. If Maino is fit, then he will return to the team and will likely be partnered with summer signing Manuel Ogate despite his early struggles, with Casemiro and Christian Eriksen not offering any more control in the middle against Porto. Mason Mount missed the Porto game with a head injury sustained late on against Tottenham, but he avoided a concussion so he could be available as another option in midfield. Marcus Rashford opened the scoring against Porto and looked in good form before being surprisingly replaced at the break, with Ten Hag insisting afterwards that he took the decision to rotate Rashford and replace Alejandro Garnacho with one eye on Villa, and he will be on the starting 11. You would expect both to start this weekend, though the versatile Joshua Zarkizi could be shifted out to one of the white positions if Ten Hag would prefer to keep Rasmus Holland through the middle after he scored the second in Porto. And the starting 11 will be Onana, Mazurawi, Maguire, Martinez, Dalot, Mayino, Eriksen, Garnacho, Fernandez, Rashford and Holland. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to subscribe to keep updated.